Hi friends, in our today's video, I'll show uh, a rotameter. So, so how a rotameter works, or uh, how the liquid level measure in rotameter, it shows as in our this uh, this video. So let's get started so we see construction and working of rotameter so first of all uh, it consists of a tapered transparent glass tube with small diameter at bottom that is a ti which is uh, mounted vertically and uh, it is uh, at the top it is bigger that is tf Oh, sorry TF okay and the flow is to be measured is entered in the mm, tube from the bottom side the inside the tube there is a float or bob with grows on the body which has higher density than the fluid the fluid moves float upwards and downwards okay the float will rise to a point in a tube where is the upward drag force and beyond uh, beyond force is balanced by the downward directed weight of the float downward directed weight of the float okay so when the float achieved some level in the tube it is a direct indication of a flow rate okay so it is a simple method uh, to determine uh, a level measurement in rotameter so in the most of uh, industrial applications the rotameters are used because uh, it is a uh, simple in construction simple to fix and easy to use but its cost is uh, high as we uh, increase the cost it uh, increases the accuracy so thank friends for watching this video if you understand that video so please like share and subscribe my channel to see more videos so thank friends bye bye